so much for clicking thank you so much for stopping by this is your salon babe your serial young to see and to net thank you so so much in today's video we are making a very simple and easy recipe we're just preparing cottage okay we are preparing cottage local style cottage in fact a day that is how we call it here and this is very simple and easy to make you don't need a lot of ingredients you don't need to spend lots of money it's just basic just basic so these are the things that we need to make this cottage work we need um sweet potatoes we need yam and i'm just using one yam you don't need that size actually you can use a smaller one and i am using bonga fish so you can either use bonga fish or you use herring this is a local dish so it's best when you go local so when you use the bonga or the herring you know it's the aroma just gives it that nice you know you know and you love it so just go low and you enjoy it trust me and yes yeah, so i'll be using three of that and i'll be using pepper onion just to be brought seasoning cube and yes i'll be using palm oil and i'll be using just that little amount of palm oil because i was not in the mood to eat palm oil but my husband wanted palm oil so um i just said let's meet at the midpoint of its ejection <laughs> a little bit of palm oil so it's a win-win for the both of us and then i'll be using this one cassava you guys I had a bowl of cassava but I woke up this morning to a spoiled bowl of cassava. Everything has rotten. <laughs> it is all rotten, rotten. It is all rotten. So I just had to throw all away and that is the only surviving one. So the first thing that goes in is the cassava because it needs more time to boil. And after some minutes, I go in with the um, potatoes, the pepper and some seasoning cubes. After a while, I come in with the palm oil, as you guys can see, the red guy, okay? And then I added the yam to it as well, so that everything just falls nicely, okay? Very easy and straightforward, right? So at this point, you should see how thick it is. That means it is coming together nicely. And the last thing that goes in is the um, plantain because these are ripe plantains and they don't take long to cook. So you don't want to add them too early. You, you just add them immediately before the onion and then after a few minutes, everything is done. And yeah, my pottage is ready, a better ready, okay? This is how simple it is. Just go in with all of your ingredients and make sure you put the, the, the stronger ones first and then you can come up to the plantain lastly. And that's just it. Simple, okay? Simple but delicious. Make sure you try this, you guys, and let me know what you think. Thank you so so much for watching. If you have not subscribed, what are you waiting for? Please hit the red subscribe button and join this family until my next video. Bye bye. Mwah.